We're back. We're back. I'm we are I'm back. Cyrus. Yeah. That's and me. I'm, I'm Owen Palisade, and you can That's call you. me Elizabeth if you want. Yeah. Hi, yeah, you could call me Nate. I don't care. I like being yeah, called you Nate. Know. Hey, I you know what's fucking cool? What do you, what? This level. This you. level is really cool. Oh, that's so nice. He. This is a really so cool it, level. What is this? This is the Space Armada. Space. I'm going to play this one in third person because it kind of gives you a better view of everything. Okay, yeah, I really want to just soak in the fucking dots. The black scape and all the dots. Like the, yeah, but There's like, some yellow dots real, and there's also some red dots. And I think some are kind of whitish and maybe kind of gray also. Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, um, it's really... How they rendered that, like, blows my mind. I'm trying to, like, force myself not to be like, well, if you played a lot of Star Fox 64, you'll recognize this, this, and this, because I should probably wait until... Yeah, just, the just, but... just wait till that actually comes up, but... Yeah. But a lot of the levels in this game kind of influence later stuff. It's pretty cool. on, on top of that, I haven't played a lot of Star Fox 64 yeah. in the past decade. That's right, so... yeah. And I have, because it's literally my favorite game of all time. Is it? Your single yes. favorite game of all time? Yes. Star Your Fox 64 one. is my number one game. I don't know what my number one is. I'm not going to have a discussion, but I'm just going to like... <laughs> like, Nier is pretty up there. That's, that makes sense. Dark Cloud's pretty up there. That makes sense. Shadow of Colossus is pretty up there. God Hand is pretty yeah. up there. That's about it. That's, I just have games that are up there. Oh, okay. This level. I know this level. I yeah, actually really, cool. really enjoy this part. Me too. I love any part of a game where you fly... A plane or something through a tunnel yeah like, and you have to do a bunch of like turning for a certain part yeah no this reminds me a lot of, of like, ace combat this i i've never played an ace combat game oh, personally damn. this reminds me though like those tunnels it reminds me of a uh, that that game show where the tetris kind of piece like the hole in the, like wall? the, the what hole in the wall yeah hole in the wall it reminds there, me of hole in the wall uh fun fact about hole in the wall I'm not gonna link you to it, but yeah, there is, I you were in a tournament of it on stream. Yeah, there is footage of me on the internet playing a hole in the wall at a tournament, a fighting game tournament in Tallahassee, Florida. I will give you, you might, that information. You, you might ask you... yourself how hole in the wall is a fighting game. Mystery game. <laughs> it was like the idea was we're not gonna tell you what this game is, but sign up for it, and we'll tell you when it's time to play it. Well, so we did. I... The idea is that you're playing hole in the wall, but it's harder because people are constantly trying to fight you while you're trying to fit into the, the wall. Yeah, so you gotta you gotta get really good at your hole in the wall footsies. Yeah. Like your fucking hole in the wall block strings. Um. You know, I've made I've uh, I've made my own variation on uh, on Yahtzee. I wanted to adapt it to a fighting game. I call it footsies. Ooh, okay. Tell me about it. It will. Okay, so so Yahtzee one was a, a big hit. There's no doubt about that. <laughs> but I, I feel like it didn't That's have the strategy that it should have had, you know, the the knowledge in, of spacing okay. that it should require. So, yeah. you know, this I've, is a I've, this is a good bit. I like what you're doing here. Thanks. You know, I, I I've, I'm very familiar with making fun of David Serlin. Yeah. So <laughs> this is not the first David Serlin joke I've made. I uh I minored. I got my, my minor in uh, making fun of David Serlin. Oh man. I got a, I got my uh, masters in candy bars. Those fields my... are always higher. <laughs> yeah. I feel like this music might have come back in a later game, but I'm not sure. It's it it feels weird. familiar, but it also feels kinda of bad. Actually like, I think it was not... just in like in like Brawl or something. Maybe That's like it's sorry. not a it's not a, like a bad song I guess but it's kind of boring. Yeah. I, oh, I think, you're gonna I think it's alright in some part. parts, but it's just kind of like. Is this, this the hardest tunnel? This is the boss fight. Um, oh okay. Whenever you hit those, it like flips. And yeah, it's yeah. gonna go. I fucked up and it. I fucking smashed my wing all over the place. So. Yeah, well. Uh, you can break your wings off in this game, also. Yeah, which is cool because it makes it easier to fit through this tunnel. So no, it sucks because you. you lose your good lasers. Yeah, no, it's great though because if you were a speedrunner, that's not true. Look, I don't know anything about Star Fox. I'm don't a baby, and yeah, I've never yeah. heard of this game. I was born in 1998. 
Yeah? Mm-hmm. Okay, that makes sense. Um, yeah. So, I want to say something about this boss fight right here. I want to say, Star Fox was not like a super late SNES game, as far as I know. Um, but I mean, you could just you could just check the date before you make claims like that, Bucko. I guess I can. I'm just trying to avoid like making clacky sounds on my keyboard. Star Fox was released in 1993 in Japan, and also okay. that same year in all the other countries too. This boss fight will probably feel very familiar to you, to me personally, or to anyone who has played a lot of Kirby Superstar. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is that this one is boss. literally Nova. Oh, like, this sucks. Yeah, this is like shitty Nova. That game yeah. came out. Shitty, shitty Nova. Yeah. I don't know. This fight's kind of cool. It's just there isn't really a lot to it. You just like blast these things on the wall a couple times. And that's it. And there's no music. So it's just kind of like... Yeah, this is... very dull. God damn! That was exciting. It's cool though, like, in a way. Yeah, it's really cool. But that, that's I'm, long. I'm five years old and this is really cool. What? Hey! Come on! It was the fucking Super Nintendo. I'm five years old and I've never seen a video game before and this is really cool. Did you hear about that one guy that was like, <laughs> I'm gonna raise my kid on video games. Yeah, that felt the, fucked up to me. The real way and do a little social experiment. Don't fucking so use your if, children for like fucking social experiments, you creep. So what if I only show Pac-Man in Pong to my baby, but then as he grows up, I show him Nintendo and then Super Nintendo. What if I just force my child to be a small version of me? What if I just like make my kid like the things that I like because I can't grasp the concept of? What if I refuse to admit that my child has agency? <laughs> well, you know what if? I'm I'm here to I'm here to answer that question today by forcing my kid to play a bunch of bullshit for my childhood. That sucks. You know what doesn't every day suck? My, every day my kid goes to school and his friends are talking about. Halo and Half-Life 2 or whatever. I don't know what's popular these days. <laughs> Half-Life 2, yeah. And my kid responds, Yeah, well, I got the high score in Pac-Man. I beat all the scores from ass. God. God. Can okay. you believe I'm finally better than ass? Yeah, you are. You, Aza, are better than ass. Wow. Very few things are better than ass in life, and I'm one of those things. Certified better than ass. I, you should get that on like a certificate and hang it on your wall. Yeah. I like that. Me too, it'd be like a great bumper sticker or something. Better than ass. Certified better than ass. Voted better than ass, 2015. Years, years 2012 to 2015. Yeah, that sounds that sounds like a accurate way of putting it. Cool. Also, this level, uh, this level really sucks. Why? It looks fine to me. There's all these big rocks. Mhm. Mm and ah, oh, shit, I missed a fucking bomb there. Um, this is the level that like forces you to learn to use your boosters, like not boosters, your brakes, because it, it throws these rocks at you, mm -hmm. and there's no way to dodge some of them. So the, I don't get it. What do you do? If, how does breaking help? I mean, the only way to like have time to react to them is by breaking a lot of the time, because otherwise the draws that draw distance is so shit. Okay, I see. I thought you were saying like if if you break, they get bored and go home. No. Also, they hit the checkpoint behind this weird gate, which doesn't really make sense. Well, because you don't get the checkpoint if you don't like, go through the gate. That makes sense to me. I mean, it's no. I, I mean, pretty, I think it's pretty clear actually. I no, I mean, like you have to shoot open that gate to see the checkpoint, and they're usually just like right in the middle of the level. I don't know. I just think that was a little strange. Well, you know, this is the game's getting hard. Okay, it took it took the kitty gloves off, and it's time to time to really step it up. Yeah. Si se puede, Nate. What? Oh God! It means yes, Stop we it! Can. Stop! Keep that out of this. I knew where you were going. 
You then you never know where I'm going. So okay, so I'm noticing it looks like your companions are not in any danger at all. No. They have health bars, but they are almost never in any danger. I, I've also, basically seen them take almost no damage. This boss also sucks. Mm -hmm. Have you considered that maybe you sucks? Yeah, I've considered that I sucks a lot, to be honest with you. Okay. Kind of like the really janky animation on this where the legs just kind of... Yeah, it looks like it's doing the hokey doing the, pokey. It's doing it's the fucking, like, like, like give him the razzle dazzle push. thing. <laughs> it's doing the can can with one leg. Uh oh, uh -oh. Broke a wing. your wing is shitty. Yeah, I fucking you broke got, it right off. You got a case of the bad wings. Gotta go to a space animal hospital for that. Space, anyway, vet space uh, veterinarian. We're doing pretty well. Yeah, I guess. This Except is your shield fine. is almost out and you don't have a wing. And This is fine. We're doing no, fine. It's, no, it's embarrassing, actually. I'm, I'm honestly, frankly, embarrassed. This is fine. No, it's not. This is fine. Hey, is that the moon to the right over there? Yeah. In the background? Why don't you shoot the moon? Haha, <laughs> that's pretty good. Yeah. I like that. I see. Yeah. You. you get a bunch of cards if you shoot the moon. God damn it! I was at the very end. You died? Yeah, I fucking died. But hey, you know what owns? You literally. Shitty clown. 3D transitions. <laughs> yeah! It felt very oh, in the spirit God. of. It felt very in the spirit of the game to use shitty 3D screen. Yeah, wipes. no, I, I agree. I agree. That's some good ending. <laughs> Anyway, let's, let's do this right fight again. again. Correct. You put your fifth leg in, you put your fifth leg out. <laughs> the fifth leg is uh, three times ruder than the third leg. I mean, not three times, three increments ruder. Increments? How much is in an increment? Like a unit. Okay. That makes a lot of sense. Yeah, like a like a standardized measurement. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I, I see I see that makes a lot of sense. Mm hmm Let's not die to this boss this time. Yeah, let's not. Sorry, I'll, I'll do my best. Nate. Yeah, you, you better not fuck this up, Eliza. Ambisagoris, I'll try Don't not to die on Don't call me that. Don't fucking call me that. You said, you said that that was your name. Oh, shit. I have backed myself into a hole here. I'm just Nate, okay? Alright. Okay, there we go. Alright, actually, Palisagris is over and we're just, uh, Na Nataliza now. I don't like that because that sounds like the name Natalie, which is a different name. Oh. I mean, there's nothing wrong with the name Natalie, but that's not my uh, no. name, it's not your name. Yeah, that, that's the problem. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna workshop it, I'll get back to you. Okay. You got like 16 seconds to workshop it. No, I can take bring it back <laughs> another video. Okay, yeah, that's All fine. Alright, so uh, see you next time with the thrilling conclusion of Star Fox SNES. Star Wipe 64. <laughs> <laughs>